it to I want it to three, four. I guess I got into jazz, started playing piano and it didn't really didn't really click and then I got into guitar and I played mostly rock and stuff but I for a couple of years and then got into community music when I was 12 which is the sort of prep program here so I guess I've been around Humber for uh, many many years. I've been full-time at Humber uh, for about the last nine years I believe. I guess when I, I started playing piano very young but I studied it until I was about 17 18 and then I came to Toronto at that time Humber was really the only the only game in town you know um, so I, I, I went to Humber for three years I'm very proud of him I think he's really worked hard and uh, really come up with a, a very valid sort of voice of his own and uh, so it's a pleasure to, to listen to for me and a pleasure to play with him. In fact we used to play together a bit more on the house and stuff and I, you know, I kind of miss that. It was, uh, it's, it's, you know, got to do some more of that. People were, I came up over dinner last night, somebody was asking where to record and it's like, you know, Humber. And it's not just because, you know, a lot of people I know teach that they plug it. You know, it's actually a really good studio. <laughs> I'd have to say the same thing, you know, the recording studio is amazing. I've done, uh, you know, there's, there's so many, you know, probably a hundred student projects done there a year, as well as, uh, I mean, I've done at least three, four CDs, that, you know, they've been recorded there, so it's, it's a great facility. You get students coming here and they're going to, uh, you know, the, not only is there a jazz element, but there's all sorts of, like, there's a Brazilian ensemble, there's a couple of more Cuban-oriented ensembles, uh, there's fusion groups, there's, um, uh, there's a bluegrass ensemble, there's all, you know, there's all sorts of different types of music, which, and you never know how that's going to, um, you know, get into someone's sensibilities and affect their music later on. <laughs> 